Jesus fucking Christ, ladies and gents, I was grinding in preparation for the second episode and I found this goddamn shiny? Shiny Zigzagoon? Holy fucking save state right now. Oh my god, I am not gonna stop until I get this shiny. Holy shit on my balls right now. That's never happened. Ladies and gents, we might want to use this. I might want to fucking use this even. I don't even care. I mean, I have Leroy, but it's gonna turn into a non-normal type in the future, right? Are we gonna fucking use a Lion in this playthrough? The hell we are. Only because you're shiny. Only because you're shiny. Jesus Christ, that actually... I was actually at a loss for words for a few minutes there. When I first caught this. Every... It shined, like... I was speeding through it and it shined. I'm so glad that I caught that. Oh my god. Hell yeah. That's my... By the way, that's my first shiny in like... Four years. Jesus Christ. The last one I found... The last time I found one was like... So long ago already. Like, it was like a hack game. I don't know. Jesus, that was so weird. Um... What do we want to name a male Zigzagoon? What about Zeke? Sure, I'll name you Zeke. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hello, internet. Welcome back to the Runiverse. Aaron here with some more Pokemon Saffron. Previously, we explored the first parts of this map. Uh, that was our lo our hometown, Anba Town, and now we arrived at Aranda. Pretty long route all the way here we got we had to go to like two caves or something haba cave or whatever that was and now as i promised last episode we are going to take on the gym but before we do that i just want to say um well if you saw that uh connector video that i put before this i got a shiny fucking zigzagoon while i was grinding my pokemon that is right ladies and gents this is as good as it can get my first shiny in so long and I get it in a playthrough. So I caught it on video, meaning this will be immortalized in my life. I cannot believe it. Definitely that's going to be my thumbnail. I don't even care about the gym leader. This is going to be my thumbnail. Fuck it. And um, as you can see for the rest of my team, I'm going to train Zeke in a bit. I actually want to use this guy as part of my team too. Um, everyone else has gotten to about level 8, level 10. I did some grinding off screen, uh, like I mentioned. And also... Last episode, I technically, I kind of forgot actually to check out uh, Heather's stats. She's in a quick ball. That's actually cool. She's holding a potion too, which we will actually take. Thank you, Heather. And let's check back into your summary. Um, so she has incredible stat. Like, nature is great. Plus attack, minus special defense. I would have sort of preferred that she had a plus special attack since a lot of really good um, electric type moves are indeed special attacks, but it doesn't really matter. You know, 12 special attacks still pretty good, it's neutral. And you have guts, so if you get poisoned or paralyzed or burned or something, your attack's gonna go up. That's amazing. And as we check out Zeke over here, I think we already checked him out in the connector video, so it's fine in the intro video. That's fine. I think we are ready right now to take on the gym. I might actually put Heather up front for now because Edna does not seem to have any good moves. Wait, no, I didn't show you that yet. Yeah, Absorb, Supersonic, and Astonish are all it has. And that's pretty shit right now, but don't worry. Uh, we're going to get a return of investment pretty much later on. Anywho, are there any good moves right now? No. Are there any good berries we can like let our Pokemon hold? Oh, by the way, yeah. Um, I, uh, since my... What do you call this? My Eevee recently learned Kvet, and that actually steals a Pokemon's items while attacking it. I was able to farm some Chillin Berries from Rattataz. I don't know why they had those, but that's pretty cool. I'll give that to maybe... Nah, why not? I'll give that to Heather to hold, maybe eat. Um, is there anything else we can let our Pokemon's hold? Maybe give the second one to Leroy because that's the, these are the only two Pokemon we're going to use for this gym battle which we will go check out I don't actually know what Pokemon she's using hey this here's a grass type gym so don't come in with water type Pokemon don't get down if you lose Erica's one tough cookie good luck ah Jesus so you're telling me Edna's supposed to be our savior here 
I mean, let's... Damn it, you only have Absorb! I mean, let's try one trainer. Oh, you have four trainers here, that's cool. Let's see if I can actually deal any damage with Edna using these guys. So you have a level 8 Sun Current, it's a good thing I grinded. I can't use Absorb, so let's try Astonish. I really wish I had something like Wing Attack, it would be so easy right now. But we do kind of have to switch into Leroy, because that's gonna take forever if we try to beat them with Edna. That fucking Bulbasaur out here. Jesus. Joey, Tamer Joey, flexing. And then we shall switch back to... Actually, no, let's try switching out to Heather. Let's see if you can do any damage. Apparently not, because you're going to growl me, and that's going to be... Oh, I hate you. I hate you. Uh-oh, you're going to kill me. That's sad. Alright, get out here. Leroy, that's good. And on that note, we are going to go heal. Oh my god, I thought it was night. It just changed right away. What is going on? It's 11 p.m. as I'm recording this. Why would it change to not nighttime? Something's wrong right now. I don't know. I have real time clock set on in my vi in my VBA, so maybe that's fucking something up with the uh, um, settings of this game. But that's okay. Let's do this. Tamer Sherry. Why are you called Tamers? What does that mean? Heather, let's try you again. Tackle. Oh, that's gonna be that's gonna be so annoying. Let's leer you real quick. And let's see how much tackle does. Oh, a lot now. That's good. Sunkern. We'll switch back to Edna. We will go back to Heather. And then we shall leer you. Leer you again. And tackle you. Sweet. That's good tactics right there. Level 9 now for both. Got charge. Okay, so um, still no good moves for Edna, but we shall keep on keeping on. Do we need to heal? Nah, it's fine. We'll heal when we get to the Pokemon. Ah, uh, what the hell? The gym leader. Aren't these flowers beautiful? Why is there a Bulbasaur there? What in the world is happening? The royal will take us on. Uh, Kvet. Alright, one more. That's good. Sweet! That's all you had. These guys have starter, starter grass types. That actually... A bit too overpowered for me. Not holding back. Oh, these guys ain't playing. Got another Bulbasaur out here. I would prefer seeing something like a... I don't know. What do you call that one? The Johto one. Johto one. Chikorita. Why do I blank out there? You just cancelled out my Leer with your attack. That's fine. Oh, god damn it. That's fine. We'll just soften you up a bit for Leroy. Kvet. Seriously. All I'm missing is good moves. Ugh, man. Like these older games, they... They really fuck you up. Dude, it's daytime now. Something's really wrong. Maybe I should turn off real-time clock with this game or something. I don't know. I'll do that in the next episode. I, I'm hoping it doesn't it doesn't affect anything. Maybe the berry? Like, some, maybe the berries will be fucky? I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't mind. Like, I did see berries growing or something. It's not really something Fire Red is supposed to do. Anyway. Well, we're good enough levels. Good enough levels, but we don't have good attacks. That's the only thing. Oh, what the hell? Aw, Lobosaur out here. And you also have that really cute Sunkern. So, uh, real quick, we'll see if we can defeat... That's Erica. yeah. We'll defeat Erica. I will save slot real quick. Save state. So this is Erica of Kanto, then. Um, do I want to switch train Edna? Probably not. I'll try to lead off with Heather to get some leaders off her first Pokemon. Because we might lose if we try to switch train on a fucking gym leader. Anyway, it's fine. Isn't it lovely in here? The flowers are just so... Oh, I should introduce myself. My name is Erica, leader of the gym. Well, I'm the leader when this region is populated and active. When the migration ends and the people leave, I go back to my home in Kanto. So you are double dutying. Uh, th you know, salute to you. I work at Celadon. In fact, the next in line... Yo, I'm next in line to be the Celadon gym leader. Is this like a prequel? That's interesting. So this is like before the events in Kanto happen. That's cool. I guess being the leader here is good practice. Oh, you wanted to challenge me. Very well, but I should not lose. So that's why the Pokédex was like the first ever thing. Like it's in early stages or something. You have three Pokémon. Oh dear. Not something I want to see. I really hope you don't have anything scummy. I mean, you're the first gym leader of this game after all. Or is this going to be one of those hacks? Alright, no speed ups. Let's find out. I will leer you first. Because tackle won't do anything. For me. 
Heather has high as fuck's um, attack stat though. How much does this do? Ugh, not enough. You're gonna raise your special attack like the bitch you are. I will keep tackling. It's a three hit kill, so that's fine. Hopefully you won't heal there. You won't, that's good. We can take you out easy peasy. Yep. All right, lots of experience there. Do you gain a move? It would be sweet if you did. No, we don't, but that's fine. Um, let's stay in, because we did get a little bit more powerful here. Okay. I don't... And uh, charge is useless right now, because I don't have an electric-type move yet, but that's fine. We shall leer you once. Lower your defense once again. Maybe another 3-hit kill, or a 4-hit kill this time. Global swords are notorious for being bulky as fuck. Uh, I don't think I need to heal yet. I will tackle, I outspeed you, I get some damage off. Yeah, you are definitely a 4-hit kill. Ooh, I'm down. 3 HP, I shall use one of my potions. I stocked up real quick right there. I'm just gonna spam Vine Whip. Hopefully you don't get any uh, crits or anything. So I'd upspeed you and get one more tackle in there. Ooh, that means I'm gonna kill you, right? Oh no, got a high roll. Not a fan of that. Leroy, you're my only hope now. Please win this. Uh, Kavet. Yes, I outspeed. That's good. Sweet stuff. Lots of experience for that too, I hope. Not really. But you are level 11. Oh my god, you have Sun Flora already? Jesus Christ. Alright, let's... Let's try it. Let's try it out. See if I can beat you. Maybe I should have trained Zigzagoon for this. Don't go easy on me, give me everything you've got. Oh, it has like that level, um, has like the Gen 4 style where the the trainers give quips or something when it's their last Pokemon. Ooh, do I want to be scummy? I think I want to be scummy. I will sand attack you real quick. You might set up though. I feel like you're going to set up. Oh yeah, you're definitely setting up. Alright, sand attack once and then I shall covet. How much does that do? Maybe I don't need to tail whip you. Oh, I do need to tail whip you. You're setting up, I don't like it. I really don't like it. Shoot, I need to tail whip you. At least twice. At least twice, you're bulky. Oh god. Dude, how do you hit with a 55 accuracy move? I know Grass Whistle is a 55 accuracy move. Oh god. Please don't die. Am I gonna lose the first gym, gym battle of the game? She's spamming groats. She's plus three special attack now. I'm so fucking scared. I am so scared, dude. I am gonna die if I sleep for five turns. What? Excuse me, what? Level 12 Sunfloor with Mega Drain? How is that fair? What the fuck? Okay, we're definitely gonna lose this. I mean... Jesus Christ, so all that grinding for nothing, we're gonna lose this. Oh, you missed. Thank goodness for that sand attack. I'm still asleep, like the bitch boy I am. Oh, and I missed again. Oh my god. Did that sand attack just save us? No, because Leroy is still fast asleep. And I think we're gonna die here. Yeah. Oh, that is very unfortunate. That was that's a GG right there, I think, for us. Unless Edna could pull something off. I might reset because I don't want to lose my money to this girl. Um, I really wish I had good moves. Seriously, I would wipe the floor if I had good moves on Edna right now. Supersonic, and of course I miss because of course that's how things work. So I miss with my 80 accuracy supersonic, but you somehow hit with your 55 accuracy grass whistle twice in a row. That's totally fair. Totally fair. I am salty. I'm sorry. Not gonna lie, I'm super salty right now. Sunflower has OP moves, and we don't have anything to answer. I will search after this, maybe. I will pause the video and I'll grind a bit more, because we're definitely losing this battle. That's plus 4 on your growth now. Anyway, yeah. When does Edna learn, uh, fucking... What do you call that? When do you, when does Edna learn wing attack on this generation? Is that level 12? Or level 14? I don't care. I'm gonna get her to that level, because I wanna fucking wipe the floor with you when I beat you. I'm just gonna let you... 
beat me this time around. I I feel like there's really no chance at all that I'm gonna lose this. I'm gonna win this at all. Astonish does literally nothing. If you hit yourself, no, you hit uh you hit me thrice in a row with grass whistle now. Watch me, if I have Grass Whistle on, I will never hit it. I will never, ever hit with Grass Whistle. But you do. Wait, is, is Grass Whistle maybe buffed in this hack? Who knows? Who knows? It is very scummy. You are a very scummy gym leader, Erica. I don't like you. How much does that do? Well, you do enough damage. You do more damage to yourself than I do to you. And the sunlight faded, so... Uh, I, I'm still fast asleep, and I think you're gonna snap out of confusion. Yes, you will. Because that's just how you like to do your stuff. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So, okay. I'm going to predict I'm going to go five turns. Five turns to sleep, right? Plus five now on your growth. So even though Mega Drain is not very effective, you are pro probably just going to two hit or one hit me. This is such a slow burn right now. Such a slow burn. And I miss again. That's pretty cool. Okay. Let's try, let's, ooh, critical hit. Can we actually win this? No, you have a potion. You have a potion. You have a super potion. I just know it. And uh, I will supersonic you real quick. Ooh, you missed. Yay, for once. For once, I hit supersonic too. That's good. Twice in a row. I feel like if, I, if you hit yourself and I also get an astonish, I can actually beat you. That would be the dream. Unfortunately, it's not really going to happen, is it? Nope. But you are going to miss again. So I have that going for me, which is nice. Okay. Once again, you're going to go down to your heal zone, and you're going to snap out right away. And you're out of grass whistles, thankfully. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What the hell? A Ganlon Berry. The defense rose, so it literally cannot hit you anymore. Oh, you don't have potions. What? Oh what? How many? How much PP does Grass Whistle have? What the hell? I thought I only had 5 PP. Can you hit yourself for the win? This would be amazing. Nope! You can hit Grass Whistle instead. Jesus Christ! How much PP does Grass Whistle have? I thought I only had 5. You have 10 PP to Grass Whistle? That is so... Please hit yourself. Please hit yourself. I just need you to die. Please hit yourself. Oh my god. Please, 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 please. This is so annoying. This is such an annoying... This is such an annoying battle right now. I am so... I am getting pretty angry. I am getting irritated right now. Please. You die now? No! Oh my god, but I killed you with Astonish. What the fuck was that game? I absolutely thought I was gonna lose that game. I was preparing to rage. I already was raging technically, but... How the hell did we win that? That was so scummy. I am angry at this game, but I still like it. Because that provided me one hell of a challenge. I don't like to be challenged, but I thought that was going to be a chill hack playthrough. I guess not. That was a delightful match. I felt inspired. That was not delightful at all for me. It was... It was... But you know what? It was challenging. You know what? That's fine. I was challenged. Feeding a gym leader is quite an accomplishment. You should be proud. I have a gift for you as a reward for winning. As a reward, rather. What is this? Bullet Seed? Well, at least it's not awful. Good luck to you. The next gym is surely a challenge. This already was a challenge. Oh, boys and girls. Looks like he clutched that with Edna. That was... That was actually incredible. Pog champs in the chat. I guess I'm... I was irritated because I wasn't expecting that much of a challenge for the first gym. I was expecting like a breeze through. Oh, well. Looks like we have all we need to expect from this game. Um, I guess we have time now. That was such a long battle. We do have time to uh, explore the rest of this place. I shall put Edna in front as I want her to get some better moves. Do we have a rival battle with Kira here sometime or somewhere? Where does this lead? Can we now go to the mainland? Oh yeah, we can. What the hell? Hi there. That's Birch. Ah yes, I am Bodoy. Sunny is my brother. Who's Sunny? I've heard so much about you. I've actually just ran into your brother on the boat over here. Oh, that is my brother. Did my mom actually mention my brother's name last episode? I just forgot. Oh, well. Uh, I think Professor Oak wanted us to meet him back at the lab. We have lots of research. Now, uh-huh. Where is Anne Baton exactly? Ah, okay, thanks. See you there. Damn it. I really wish you would have teleported me. That's fine, though. Ahoy! You've been eating an Azira pass to ride this boat. Well, 
I guess we are forced to just go down. It would have been awesome if he just fucking teleported us there with him or some shit like that. But alas, this game does not like us for some reason. I mean, kind of likes us. Gives us a shiny zigzagoon. I feel like my luck completely ran out with that shiny zigzagoon. I think it's going to be downhill from here. Oh well. Oh well. That's okay. Oh, what the hell? Bodoi, do you think you could lead me through Haba Cave? Great, let's go. What's the point of this? Thanks, Bodoi. I'll see you at the lab. Oh, well, that's, that's cool at least. At least they give me that. Oh. I just want to check if this guy has any more berries. Apparently, he does not. Uh, wild Pokemon here. Nah, I don't want to take this out. It's fine. Hmm. We'll grind off screen. I like grinding off screen. Wait. Oh, yeah. This is the place to go. Hi, Bodoi. I wanted to thank you for meeting Professor Birch at the pier. For your big help. Now, we have some things to discuss. There have been a rather large amount of sightings of a Pokemon called Raikou around the mainland. Raikou is native to the Johto region, so I'm not quite sure what one would be doing all the way out here. Uh, the legendary beasts are very efficient travelers, so it's not too far-fetched for it to make its way here, but why? Uh, I got in contact with a professor in the Johto region who said he would send me all of the data he has on Raikou. Hopefully he has something to get us started with so he can pin down where Raikou is and study it. Alright, Birch and I are going to head to the mainland and ask around about the sightings. I need you to follow us there and do some field research. Uh, while you're doing your usual data collection in the Pokedex, see if you can get us some leads to work with. To get to the mainland, you will need this. Ooh, yay, we have the Azira Pass now, that's good. That's good. Just show that pass to the captain and he will take you to the mainland. I'm sure our paths will cross plenty of times over there. And I will see you soon too. Oh, I almost forgot. There are rumors circulating that Team Rocket is making their way here from Kanto. Oh dear, we have Team Rocket right now. They're a very dangerous group with an extensive history of criminal activity. I don't know what they're up to, but it can't be good. Keep an eye out and stay safe. Uh, hell yeah, I'm gonna follow you. Because I don't want to have to walk back there myself. Hell yeah. Oh, what the fuck? Did not mean to press that. Oh well. That's good, we get to finally teleport back. Thank you, ROM hack makers, for that. And, uh... I guess we'll... Oh, what the hell? Who are you? Oh, that's Sunny. So it's not Brandon. Okay. How are you? How's mom? I'll have to swing by the new house and see her. So this is our brother. We don't really look anything alike, do we? Do you two like it here? Good. I'll be here for the duration of the migration event, then it's back to the Hoenn for me. So, uh, did you get your first Pokemon yet? Great! We'll have to battle one these days. So you don't battle me right now. You wanna battle now? Okay. Look at a big head with one gym badge on your belt. I've been a Pokemon trainer for a while now. On top of all eight Hoenn badges, I've defeated gym leaders from various other regions. You wouldn't stand a chance. Well, if you insist. I guess if there's anyone to knock you down a peg, it's me. What are we getting ourselves into? I didn't even say a word. I would've been perfectly okay. That's a nice battle background, too. Well, I think we're meant to, uh, <laughs> I think we're actually meant to lose this battle. That's a level 42 Swampert. Jesus Christ. I actually want one of those. Damn, Absorb would be sick if that was like Mudkip or something. That's fine. Dude. Dude, why are you going all out on me? You have a fucking Mega? You're going Mega on level 10 Zubat? Dude. My goodness. Damn. It'd be incre incredible if you actually live this. That would be amazing. Hmm. Ooh, I want to flex my uh, shiny Zigzagoon. Ah, oh, yeah. Suck it. Suck it, my dude. I mean, you have a full team right now, and you're way stronger than me, but suck it. I have a shiny. I have a shiny. Probably something you've never, ever seen in your life. Oh, wow. I actually get to land an attack on you. One damage. We shall tail whip. Nope. Guess we can't do that. Nice animation for Mud Bomb, though. Oh dear. Well, this is sad, actually, because um, we're meant to faint now, but maybe Edna will lose some happiness points from that, so it's gonna be a while before she evolves into a Crobat. Sad. Let's just get a quick attack. Scummy quick attack on level 42 Swampert. <laughs> I would assume we have a fighting type attack for me, but I guess not. That's fine. And finally, just take me out. Just take me out. Uh, I don't know. Fucking Leer. I'm not gonna land an attack on you anyway. There we go. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Told you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Let me heal your Pokemon. I have plenty of potions. Thank you for that, I guess. 
You're a new trainer, you'll get there. We'll, we'll battle again some other time once you train more, deal? I got somewhere to be, so I'll catch you later. See you around, Bodoy. So I figured you're really supposed to lose that battle, but what if, like for some really odd reason, you hack the game at this point, and then you actually get a team that can destroy him? That would be cool. I feel like it would glitch the game out so bad or something. But, I don't know. It's fine, though. Uh, let's just go to the mainland at this point. Where can I take you? Sandia Town. Let's go there. All aboard. Fast craft. Super jet. Ocean jet. Sandia Town. The ancient stone village. Okay. Oh, fuck. Fuck, I was about to end the episode. You know what? You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna end it here. Fuck you, Akira. I will battle you next episode.